Hello everybody and welcome to another video and tonight we will be playing a horror game called Unknown Tapes which this is a horror game about dinosaurs and trying to survive it's like it has that found footage VHS type of feel and effect or filter I mean I could only imagine how it would feel seeing a damn dinosaur in this day and age imagine or at least in the forest right if it were in the city I'm pretty sure it would get taken out pretty quick but Imagine being in the forest, you go hiking or someplace with your friends, and you start seeing like T-Rexes and rept reptiles? Raptors, I mean. The following is government property. Unauthorized viewing from this file will cause serious risks to your security. The following are the recordings found in sector XW-4. Codenamed to discourage any curious people. Case codename unknown tapes. Details about 5-7 minutes after the helicopter crash, according to estimates. Oh no. So we crashed here. It's not like we got curious. Oh shoot, is that the pilot too? Damn. So that was our friend. But we survived the crash. Shift to run. Oh no. I have no idea if we're actually going to get chased by a dinosaur. Uh, to be honest though, would you really be able to outrun a fucking dinosaur? Oh no, I think we also have stamina. Oh no. Toggle the flashlights. Is this blood? This is blood. Oh! My brother. He got cut in half completely. There's something at the gate. They're messing with the gates. Oh, I love that. The noise of leaves. That's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, we did. We got to go into that place, I think. I don't like when our character has no type of stamina. And we're also, like, maybe going to get chased. Is this... Oh, this is actually something. How do we get this? Okay. This is already the second time that Dave has lost the access code to the science station. I understand that he's chief. You hear that? Oh, fuck. I understand that he is a chief scientist, but the company merger thing is really stressing him out. I'll check the warehouse later. The code will definitely be there. Where is that? What the hell is that? I think it's even creepier knowing that they probably could see me, right? And they're playing with me? Either interact. Damn, I need the code. Okay, so we gotta go to a warehouse. Oh, I think we were actually going the right way, no? Maybe? And we have an inventory. Oh, no, no, no. This is bad. I think we're going the right way. Oh! Damn, dinosaur. What is it, a raptor? Those ones are terrified because they're super fast. Look, there we go in here. We can shoot, 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 shoot. We won't go there yet. Brother? Oh, he's dead. I think he's dead. You hear that? It's cackling. You collected an audio tape. Oh, another note. Aru, 7203 72, 7203 Oh shit! Okay, I got it now. You have to be quiet. You have to be quiet. Turn off the light. I don't know if... I, I don't even know why I'm... Oh my god. He's blind, right? He doesn't see the flashlight? Look at that mohawk, though. Sheesh. Oh my god. Thank god he's blind. And he doesn't see the damn light shining into his eyes. Look at him. Oh. It's like he looked like them chickens from Ark. Now or never, walk, crouch, 
to make as little noise as possible. They can hear you. Oh, so they can actually hear like the grass. Look at it. I'm not even going to try to run. To go unnoticed, it is better to move crouched and stand up and far enough away. Runa makes a lot of noise. Be careful. He's eating our brother. Eat him up good. I'll be passing by you. Look at that tail. Holy. So is this a guy that scared me earlier? You know, I'm not like a dinosaur expert or anything, but wouldn't they be able to smell you? And since technically, technically speaking, we crash landed. So we should be bleeding, right? Technically, um, actually, I think this is far enough, right? Imagine he comes running at us. This is far enough. I hope that's the guy. That's the biggest dinosaur we will find. Honestly. That dude was pretty terrifying. His noises. I wonder... Uh, I don't know if you guys ever seen... There's a video... Or an audio... Of how dinosaurs sounded. And apparently they were they look like chickens like Harry. Apparently. Allegedly. 70... Two, zero, three. Enter. Okay, we're in, we're in. Hacker mans, we're in. Clo oh, no. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. What are these? 3D printers? I, they look like 3D printers. I think they are. What were they 3D printing? Hmm. Oh, we got more? You've collected a map of the surrounding area. Oh, we actually have a map as well? Holy. Codes were there. Then we moved up here, I think, right? Oh, no. The warehouse. Helicopter crash. We went inside. Went to the right. Got in there. Little chicken boy is there. Okay, so we have a lot to explore, honestly. That is crazy. Safe. I don't know. There must be a code for this somewhere. Mmm. And that code is all the way down there. Well, that's power, though. It says electricity symbol there. If have the audio tape. Oh, I think we could check those. Now we have two now. Project R1. Oh, that's his name. Sights and hearing have been weakened, but remains lethal if in the intermediate vicinity. Great intelligence as a predator. Very dangerous. Normally and absolutely lethal in dense vegetation. Venturing into dense vegetation in its presence is equivalent to certain death. Maximum caution. Mm. We got the... The damn grass expert over there. There is a safe in the scientific station. I need a code to open it. Okay, so we need a code for that. They recently started construction on the complex on the other side of the lake in the S1 area. Dave usually relaxes on the top floor of the building because he says there's a nice view from up there. Dave seems really strange lately. I can't see him well in any case. He's probably going to get fired. I think they found out there's something really bad he did in the underground complex. I don't want to die. Well, looks like everybody died regardless of whatever they wanted to do. What does that say? We are all dead. No weapons on these guys. Is it, was it like a... Did they, like, get taken by the monsters? I mean, dinosaurs? Oh, no. You keep that on. I accidentally turned off the flashlight. You'd imagine they have guns. Or at least... I don't, I don't even know. Would they be effective against dinosaurs? Guess not. Since everybody here died. And this is, like, a scientific... Uh, what do you call it? Station. Oh my god. It's March 5, 1998. The research was successful. The it's a big boy. Apparently one bastard survived. You can seem to proceed. This Where do I go? I help you. <laughs> we'll see each other soon. 
I was so scared I didn't even realize what he was saying. I think that like little was this door, right? Opening. Oh yes. Oh uh, dinosaur. It's the spinosaurus looking ass. Damn. Okay, I thought it was a T-Rex, to be honest. That that would have been worse, but it's that one. Oh, a skull? Not good, not good. Deadly zone. Leave immediately unauthorized. We're swimming? No, surely not. We have to, right? Actually, we don't. I want to try it, though. Oh, invisible wall. I tried it, okay. Oh no, where am I going? Where am I going? Well, I'm actually going the right way. Piggy! Oh, he's die. He's gonna die. That's a death flag right there. You don't just show a pig out of nowhere. Piggy. Hey. Smack his ass so he could run away or something. You're alive, Piggy. What the fuck? How? They don't want him, but they want me? What type of shit is that? How is a pig not more like delicious for these guys? They want a whole human. Alright, hold on. Let me. I'm sorry for like just flashbanging you with a the map, but I have no idea where to go. So, okay, so straight to the left. We gotta go into the cornfields. Oh yeah, look, they even messed up the. Oh, it's the little... It's the little shits. Oh, hell do the know. We gotta go that way too for the codes. Huh. Because this is the complex. Oh, shoot. Okay. It's okay. Dinosaurs are not real. Only in this universe, and we just so happen to be in it. Oh my god. That better be the code over there, look. What's that noise? Are they like, hammering something? It sounds like it, doesn't it? A flashlight? Area V5. Am I not in the right area? But well, maybe if I don't crouch, maybe maybe we're fine here. Oh, it's a power. Oh, is that good? Pass safe. Inside scientific station building 0713. Someone's moaning by us. I'm so sorry, brother, but where's our brother? Brother. Oh, I think he died over there, huh? Yikes. Um. Okay, we got the code. So we can go back. Look at those noises. Oh, hell no. Oh no, the piggy. The piggy. I told your ass. Told your ass to run, boy. You know what's crazy though, is that even if we were to go like, into the second floor or third, we could be eyes to eyes with one dinosaur. It's kinda cool, I ain't gonna lie. I love watching the little V5s grow up. For me, it's a miracle that the discoveries resulting for my analysis for the D1 enzyme have allowed the de-extinction of these creatures. I think I'll go to the entrance of the V5 area to look around for a while. Apparently, we have an infestation of tall plants in the area. In any case, I'll just walk along the sidewalk and follow the directions on the sign placed on the fence. On the way back, I just need to be the reverse route. I'll make a report about it. Oh. Wait, so if we went into the cornfield, we could have died? And we just did the right thing by just following directions? Or not even directions, just the path? Oh, no. I hate the stamina thing. Like, you're dark. You're, you're dark. Your vision darkens. This damn flashlight may have been damaged in a helicopter crash. 
I could also shut down at any moment. What? So convenient now. Oh, shoot. How convenient, ain't it? You know what I was thinking when I was walking to this place? Isn't there a dinosaur that's also underground? Or underground underwater? And it's huge? Oh. Piggy. They got you now, huh? It doesn't look like it was a big bite, though, so we, we, might, we might be fine. Honestly. They just tickled them just a little bit. Come on, come on, come on, go inside. Surely we'll be safe in here. We gotta get that code. Wait, this door opened. It was never opened, was it? Toilet? Anybody inside? Oh, no. Goodbye, my love. Oh, someone had a wife. Oh! Well, goodbye, my life. All right, we got a code, though. It was zero. Seven, one, three. What? Are, we better get a gun. I mean, what is it going to do? I don't know, but... Oh, no, it's a note. Pass underground complex. Zero, eight, three, one. Another note. Zero, eight, three... One. It's here, it's here, it's here, it's here. It's right there. Look at Burrow. Oh, please! I just wanted to, I just wanted to see him. Oh, he's there, look at him, look at that mohawk. I guess we'll go over here. It's the same chicken dude again. Look at him. Being a sneaky boy over there. So we have to go to the underground complex, which was over there. We were right there too. It's okay. All we got to do is walk this little lake again. I love how it's like, it's giving me the creeps having to go back there. It's like uncertainty, like you you check this whole place, but now you gotta go back. And with dinosaurs, no less. Oh, look. And conveniently, our flashlight is actually gone now. It doesn't work anymore. Shoot. Oh. Oh, no. I see the game design and honestly, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Follow the lights. Oh, it works. I want to run. Wait. Ooh, ooh. Easy, birds. Not a damn bird scared. Is he coming to me? Oh, it went into the water. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, my God. Well, that was it for unknown tapes. This is like the first horror game with dinosaurs, and I actually liked it. I can I can see how the flashlight turning off is going to be like a good thing in the game where you start to add raining and lightning and sort of the lightning guides you with those instances of the flashes which is actually pretty cool the noise hearing their foot stomps hearing them just smash into the ground is insane dude those little chicken dudes are like the staple for dinosaurs in your movies especially in jurassic park it's always those little ones that end up eating people alive like those little ones that running hordes they're like little kids i forgot what the actual name was but they're like an actual species but they always ambush their enemies or humans in these cases hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you all in the next video